Extraordinary images tonight of deadly explosions felt by millions in Lebanon. Blasts that shook a city and injured thousands. This was the first, coming just after six in the evening at Beirut's main port, sending up a plume of thick smoke. Beneath it, fires raging and flashes of light filmed by nearby residents. None of them could have guessed what would happen next. A second massive explosion that some described as like an earthquake. A mushroom cloud of debris and seawater blasted into the air. The detonation was heard 200 miles away in at least two other countries. I saw something flash and I couldn't hear anymore. It was raining glass all over the city of Beirut. On the ground, dozens lay dead. Lebanon's health minister says almost 3,000 people have been injured. The port area destroyed. But what caused it? Officials tonight say a warehouse has for years been filled with dangerous explosive chemicals. Warnings about the dangers, they say, ignored. Beirut, so often a battleground in war, resembling a war zone tonight. This is a national disaster for Lebanon. Tomorrow a day of national mourning and of many questions. If this was a warehouse for dangerous chemicals, were the explosions accidental or sabotage? Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.